Hi guys, it's the UK's Black Rose. Mwah. Hi, I'm Charlie Luck. Today's show, oh my Amazing. gosh, it was so good. So good. When you see the video footage, you'll know what turn up means. One of the best jump off shows this year, hands down. Both yeah. crews were good, weren't they? Both of them. It was quite a hard one. They were good. Really good. Mm. Wow. The great judges dance. and the it crowd. Was crazy. Yeah, oh my gosh, he did so many spins. Mm. I was like, I couldn't keep up with his spin. <laughs> Josiah and Dexter, let me tell you something. Both of them are absolutely champions. So tight. I think the tightest it's ever been is, is what happened tonight, basically. And to be honest, I, was, I actually wanted to cry because I was holding up Josiah's board, who I love, but I also love Dexter. I'm a fan of both of them. So when I was cheering for Josiah, it was like, I had to chair, then when Dexter came up, I had to chair as well. You ready, tell her where to get the check, check. And it was, just, it was just so close. Well done to Josiah, because he took it in the end, so shout out to you. Josiah, Josiah, and Josiah, we have a winner for the team, Josiah! Ooh, Ooh, Hannah was so talented, oh my gosh. Oh, yes, I love Hannah. Hannah's, Hannah's I love voice Hannah. is just incredible. She's so sweet, and oh my gosh, her... Bra top today. Yeah, it's sparkly one. So cute. The music, the moment you own it, you own it. Never let it go. So sexy, she looked great. So. And they kept calling her Ariana Grande. Oh, yeah. I must have missed that. Yeah, she, she, she looked like <laughs> She looked a lot Do you think so? Yeah, she does. She I think she's kind of got her own unique look mm. in a way. But she's super cute. Yeah, she's super and cute. And so talented. I can see her going really far. Mm, definitely. definitely. Would you capture it? Or just let it slip. Or just let it slip. And Jamie Graham. Amazing voice. When I say Jamie Graham makes the ladies weak, yeah? He's just every time he comes on that stage, at least 10 of the ladies are going weak. I'll tell you that. Just now back to reality. Oh, there goes gravity. Like, he's so good. There's just something about him, yeah. isn't it? I don't know what it is, this is where they are! Just Listen, the other guy. I'll tell you something though about yeah, Sean yeah. O'Mac. Yeah. When he dropped that line about... What was it? Let me see if I can remember it. This is why I'm wearing this colour. Something about, because your mum likes it when I wear 50 shades of grey. Pop, pop, pop! Listen, when he dropped everyone that... Everyone went crazy. Everyone went crazy! It was... Listen, this is why I've lost my voice. Everyone went crazy when he dropped that. It was hilarious. I'm only your this because when I bang your mum, she likes me to wear that Fifty Shades of Grey, you faggot. Oh, wow. But then he also kind of messed up. Yeah. So he's, he still won, but he kind of messed up during the battle, which was unfortunate because I'm a fan of Sean O'Mac. Yo, listen, listen. Ah! But you know, these things happen sometimes, but I'm sorry, that bar alone about Fifty Shades of Grey killed it. He took it from there. But Ark, he was dope as well. He was good, he did his thing. Um, but he, do you remember comment. that? Like, remember what he did in the crowd when he said? Yeah, that one comment. Yeah, something about the girl in the crowd needs to go on a diet. The girl was standing right there, right at the it front. Was so, so it was like straight away, like imagine it was you. Basically, I'm just imagining if he was talking about me, I would have been heartbroken basically. And the whole crowd went nuts. They weren't too happy about that. No. There's more chance of this bitch being on a fucking diet. Yo. Hey, yo. No. <laughs> like they weren't too happy about that. So how, how it kind of like, how did she take it? yeah, the reaction, she her reaction well. was like, she actually took it well. Like, yeah, she, she did. Like, really upset. She took it well. She did take it and quite well. And she was well. like, you just need to be careful because I can boo really loudly. I'm <laughs> So, do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the crowd so she, was all on her side. Yeah, exactly. So she didn't really need to go crazy or go mad about it. So she did take it well. Her friend, but, um, you know. No. Mm -hmm. I had to apologise to her man when I got down there because I was like, sorry, they yeah. do that sometimes. Like, okay, so we had a special guest doing the pillow fight. <laughs> <laughs> she joined in. Oh my gosh. It was, do you know what? I didn't have to do it, but something just said to me, listen, I want to have fun tonight. 
I'm gonna get involved. I took off my boots because I'm wearing boots today, and I put on my trainers. And I was like, I'm getting in there. I'm gonna do where I look off some girl's head. And listen, I just went in. Black, God, it's real. It's wrong. We can't stay still. Listen, I even broke a nail. Do you know what? I was so upset. I, I won the first round, like like a soldier, but unfortunately. The second round, I didn't take, I didn't win, so. But the girl they brought up, like. She was like, when she brought up, I was like, she was what the rah, I was like, my gosh, how am I gonna do this? She was like, so tall, so like, she hovered above me, so I was just like, oh my gosh. Which one? Which one? Both of them. But I still was just like, I gotta do this, I gotta do this, I gotta win. Unfortunately, I didn't win. And you're not expecting UK's Black Rose to be on stage, like throwing pillows at gals. Your ponytail, it, it got so messy during it, but I was like, oh, I didn't care, I was just doing my thing, it was so good, I loved it. <laughs> alright, so the twerking battle, it started off all calm, it was alright, it's going well. Then they Calm, it's never calm. Well, it's them girls bouncing there. Well, what happened next? Yeah. Right? Tell them about him, my gosh. This crazy Same. guy comes out, they put him on stage. Let's mention who it is as well. Um, you guys might know him, Wong. Basically, he's an artist. You know him from Channel U days, he had a popular tune oh, out. That's where I recognize exactly, him. Exactly, yeah. Oh my god, it's more next Chinese boy, he's got on a long Okay, so he's the guy who yeah. was basically getting twerked on, but tell tell them what happened right. next. He broke out of the handcuffs. He's, he just grabbed him, oh my god, it, the crowd was going crazy, like, no one could control him. to JD Sports for sending me these lovely trainers by New Balance. I'll give you guys a peek. They're the latest New Balance trainers. Very dope. Definitely going to be rocking these to the gym. For sure. I'll be looking fly. <laughs> Very comfortable. Perfect for everyday wear as well because you know when you're going out shopping or you know food shopping, clothes shopping, you need to be in a comfortable pair of shoes. There is absolutely nothing like putting on a pair of trainers after a hard night, working at the jump off and partying at the jump off after party. I'll tell you that. You've got to have a comfortable pair of trainers and a pair of trainers that look good, like these, New Balance. Check them out. Tie them up, and they're so comfortable, man. I love them. Can't wait to wear them in the gym. They're great. Thank you to JD Sports. We're gonna rock these at Blitz Rumble. Wow. I'm the nigga that's a liar. Yeah. The moment you own it. Basically, to wear that 50 shades of grey, you faggot. Oh, bitch.